During the process of buying a home, you want to try to keep your financial picture as steady as possible. Here are a few tips of things you should not do before you close on the home. You don't want to change jobs. Keep it steady, Eddie. And in fact, if your income changes in any way, let us know. Even if it's an increase in pay, if your structure has changed, that could be a problem. Don't open up any new credit obligations. No new cars, no new credit cards. Don't co-sign anybody's loans. You want to keep your credit profile as similar as it was when you started as possible because right before closing we're going to pull what's called an lqi report and all that is that you need to know it's kind of like a refresh report and if any of your debt obligations have gone up even if you had credit and you just used it up guess what that can change the payments that we see on it and potentially impact your qualification don't move money around that you don't need to all of the money for closing has to be sourced like we have to see everywhere it's come from where it's moved over the past two months you don't want to put any money into your bank that you can't properly document so if you have cash somewhere guess what you probably don't want to go putting that in the bank during the loan process because we may have to verify it we will have to document your earnest money more than likely clearing your bank account so when we do those updates and such if we see money moving all around guess what you're gonna have to provide every statement to trail that money from its original source so point being keep your money right where it is lastly just tell us if there's anything changing if there's any change to your financial picture it is never a bad idea just to run it by us it may be completely inconsequential but you never want to assume when you're getting a mortgage so if there's any change anything if it's a debt obligation maybe you're making a payment plan to the irs or all of a sudden there's child support coming due or any of the things i've already mentioned just give us a call run it by us a lot of times it's not that big of a deal believe it or not i've had folks where they tell me my car broke down i need to get a new car it may be just fine but you don't want to assume these things so any type of financial change any decisions you have to make give us a call and we'll take care of you